Package on the way. Hello guys, uh, create tutorials here uh, with a new tutorial for you guys and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you uh, like an over edit effects that you see in a lot of over edits and stuff like that um, yeah because a lot of you request uh, over edit tutorials and really I don't I I don't know why, cause I think over edits uh, looks uh, fucking yeah I don't know why really really crappy I don't like them at all. Uh, but I really like this effect, but not too much. But yeah, uh, so let's go on uh, with the tutorial. So uh, so first of all, you just wanna make a new adjustment layer. Uh, yeah, like that, and then it's gonna uh, write wave warp in the distort menu, and just try that on, and then you see we got this now. Doesn't look that nice, but you wanna go to wave height and put it to like seven or something like that. It's good, and then wave width wanna put that to 5 so now we go get this nice effect can drag this up how much you want like but I want 7 here and maybe 6 here it doesn't yeah yeah 6 is good yeah 6.5 I'm gonna take <laughs> no 5.5 I mean no, okay, whatever. Uh, okay, and the direction you wanna take that to zero, and yeah, you can take this to high. Doesn't really matter, no difference. Uh, but yeah, when you have your favorite settings and all that, and um, put the wave height to zero, and you just go to whenever you shoot. Uh, there, you go. Then you wanna keyframe the wave height and you wanna go one, two, three, four frames and then put it to about yeah, six. I think it was. Or was it five? I don't know. Okay, and then you wanna go yeah, you can click U on your keyboard to see your keyframes and all that. And then control the shift and the right arrow key two times to go 20 frames and then take the wave height to zero and then copy them right click uh, keyframe assistant easy ease and then what you can do uh, if you have seen if or if you have been subscribed to me a long time then you probably know this um, if you uh, you can just copy and paste them uh, so like go to the second shot bam just copy this paste go to the next shot and you just continue doing that um, yeah let's take the last shot here okay so Yes, we will try to ramp preview this if we can. Just gonna ramp preview one shot because I don't have that much time. I'm gonna take this. Um. So yeah, looks pretty good. If you think it's too fast, you can drag out. You can drag out the last keyframe right there. Just gonna try to watch that again. Yeah, um, I think this effect is really cool. I really recommend using it. Um, and yeah, uh, please like and comment what you thought about this tutorial. And um, yeah, that's about it. Like the video, guys. It really motivates me to to continue doing tutorials 
uh, and request tutorials that's uh, very important and bye